What is it, gentlemen, boys and girls, and Pokemon fans of the world? It is Mega Crush, and I present you guys with another Pokemon Let's Go video. And with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, before we go any further, I want to bring a serious disclaimer to the table here and now to say that this video is a speculation video, which means that nothing is confirmed. All we're doing is having a little fun with speculation, a little fun with discussion. So please take what you're about to see and hear in this video with a pinch of salt. With that being said, guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you guys are new here to the channel. And don't forget to turn on notifications to join the Woo Squad! So with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, let's get started. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so we are here on the Poke Jungle website, and we have ourselves another article regarding Mega Evolutions in Pokemon Let's Go. Now, keep in mind, to repress this point, this is just a rumor slash speculation. It even says right here, rumor. Let's go to add new Mega Evolutions. Now, if you guys recall, I had made a video on this not too long ago, actually. In fact, I think it was like one or two days ago that we talked about this sort of subject. And what subject are we talking about here? Well, how about the fact that there were a certain batch of names that were recently re-trademarked in Japan. Now, keep in mind, ladies and gentlemen, that while this may not have any proof of anything, that the last time that we had a certain batch of Pokemon names re-trademarked, that, that was back in the X and Y era, keep in mind. There were Mega Evolutions that came about those names, you know? So, it kind of wouldn't be too far-fetched to say that maybe something like this might happen? I don't know, you know? We even have the list right here, that being Golem, Machamp, Raichu, Jinx, Starmie, Himonlee, Himonchan, Arbok, Weezing, Persian, Vaporeon, Jolteon, Flareon, and Dragonite. Now, here's the thing, is that what adds more, I guess you could say, weight to all this, more like, whoa, kind of factor, you know what I'm saying? The Chinese Riddler, a mysterious leaker who revealed hints about a variety of Pokemon correctly in the lead-up to the release of Pokemon Sun and Moon, has weighed in on the information themselves. They included a list of names and correlated them to Mega Evolution. Take a look at the full list. Well, we have the list right here, but here is the kicker, okay? We go down here and we see this. Mr. Mime has been added to the list. Mega Mr. Mime? Are you serious, bro? Mega Mr. Mime? Like, like, what would that even look like? Like, I can't even begin to imagine what Mr. Mime would look like in its mega form. Like, that is just... Oh my god. That would just be absolutely amazing, you know? Like, can you imagine? It's like, Mr. Mime, time for Mega Evolution! Woo! You know, and then all of a sudden, it's like... Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Anyways, guys, let's keep on going here. Now, we actually have ourselves an update here. The original post included Hitmontop in error. Now, here's the thing, is that uh, one of the reasons why I think they might have added Hitmontop, given the fact that it has relations to Hitmonlee and Hitmonchan, but... See, it's a Pokemon that was introduced in the Johto region, you know? Not in the Kanto region, so Hitmontop kind of got ruled out there, and I'm kind of thinking, you know, like, that seems a bit fishy, don't you think? But anyway, so, uh, it was not included by the Riddler or Trademark Filings. Now, here's the thing, is that Pokejungle actually added in their own speculation. There is actually a logic for all these Pokemon, and they make a lot of sense if they were to get new Mega Evolutions. The Elite Four and Champion all have at least one Pokemon from this pool in the original Yellow version. Lorelei with the Jinx, Bruno with Hitmonlee, Hitmonchan, and Machamp. So, yeah, that's gonna be crazy right there. Agatha has an Arbok, Lance has a Dragonite, and finally, Blue, your rival, has one of three evolutions being Vaporeon, Jolteon, or Flareon, depending on what starting you choose. I think that he meant to say starter, but anyways, like, th that kind of does make a little bit of sense, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it, it kind of wouldn't be too far off to think, you know, hey, you know, maybe he's onto something here. But here's the thing, we can't confirm anything just yet. But also, ladies and gentlemen, another connection between some Pokemon is Team Rocket, Jesse James, and their leader, Giovanni. Uh, Jesse uses Arbok, and James uses Weezing. So just imagine Mega Arbok, Mega Weezing, and not to mention Mega Persian from Giovanni, you know? That would just be absolutely amazing, like, just to see 
all of that being implemented in Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee. Now, given these Pokemon Mega Evolutions may provide a fresh spin on some of Pokemon Yellow's most iconic battles, obviously, this is just speculation. But please let us know your thoughts down below. Well, I don't need to let my you know what about my thoughts down below, man, because you're hearing my thoughts right now, man. This is absolutely crazy, dude. This is absolutely nuts. But anyways, though, guys... Uh, I really don't know what else I can say here in this video other than, you know, what do you guys think about all this? This is pretty damn crazy, even if it is just speculation, like, having all of that speculation flowing into our brains and coming up with all of these crazy ideas, man, whoo, man, the potential seems to be limitless at this point, man. This is just absolutely great! But anyways, guys, with that being said, that's going to conclude things here. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so before we end the video off right here, say, okay, let's just pretend that all of this is actually going to happen, okay? Uh, out of all of the names on the list, which Pokemon do you want to see get a Mega Evolution the most? Me, personally, I would love to see Mega Machamp, man. Like, Mega Machamp, bro? Like, that thing is just... Okay, here's the thing, is that that thing is already pretty damn powerful as it is without a Mega Evolution, you know? But just imagine it having access to Mega Evolution. I would definitely picture it having much, much higher attack than Base 130. I would say probably like Base 170 or something like that. Give it a big time buff to its defense and slight buff to its special defense and drop the speed just a little bit because I can picture it being like more bulky, you know what I'm saying? But anyways guys, that is truly going to end off this video right here. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, please be sure to smash the thumbs up button if you did. And also be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications. Join the Woo Squad. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next upload.